Alright, so what's going on guys? Now, in today's video, this one's going to be a little bit different. Um, I am about to go to Burger King and try the Impossible Whopper. Now, this is sort of totally different than any videos that I do, but I've noticed, you know, if I just make a video that I think I have an idea about or that I think maybe I should do and I just do it, it really does introduce more people to the channel and I might as well just do it because there's no hurt in not making the video unless of course it's you know Logan Paul in the woods or something but this video I think it'll be fine and I would love to take you guys along and also so if you don't know what the Impossible Whopper is it's basically a plant plant based um, burger it's called the Impossible Burger I've been waiting for this for a very long time so I'm really excited to try it um, and yeah, so we're gonna be going and I just found out FaZe Clan partnered up with Burger King to To do like a video on it and stuff and they're having like a meet so it's really cool how they're actually involving more of um, Like the you know the gaming and stuff Burger King you're very freaking smart if, if anybody from Burger King is watching this which I highly doubt Burger King is very smart, but we're gonna go ahead and get on our way guys Alright boys, what's going on? So I made it, so I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna go and get it. Alright boys, so here we go. I'm in a parking lot, and this is what she looks like. Let's take a look. We got the bag here. Let's go ahead and open her up. It smells kind of weird. Oh, it comes with a pan flit, huh? Impossible Whopper. So this was what comes in the actual... They actually put this in the bag. Impossible Whopper. It said, what is it? It's just like a classic Whopper with an Impossible Patty, blah, blah, blah. How is it cooked? It says, you know, it's cooked on the same broiler and everything, so it's not fully vegan. Um, if you're someone who's fully, fully, fully vegan. Um, what is in it? It tells you all about what's in it and everything. And why the chain? So this is what she looks like. Impossible Whopper. You got the thing right here. So here we go, boys. Here we go. Let's see what we got here. So, I mean, it smells like freaking Burger King. So I said no cheese, which they did, and everything else like that. So if we want to go and take a look here, this is what she looks like. That, I mean, compared to the freaking advertisements, nothing like what it's supposed to look like, but you know, they try. That smell, dude, that I haven't smelled in years. Now, me personally, I've had the Impossible Whopper numerous times, so I kind of know what it tastes like and I kind of know the texture. And just by looking at this patty and how it's conformed like that, you can tell it is the Impossible Whopper. That's something that you'll find different from like the regular beef and then the Impossible. Regular beef tends to have more texture and bumpiness on the outside when the Impossible, it's just like a shape. So let's go ahead and see what this is like. Damn it, probably should have got some water. Or actually, probably should have got some G Fuel. Use code CHOCK, remember that, boys. 30% off right now, gfuel.com. I mean, obviously it's good. I just took a second bite before saying anything. Damn, dude, that is crazy, man. That is freaking crazy. Let's have a closer look, boys. Um, see if I can get some focus going on here. That's not bad. <clears throat> That's not bad. I mean, I can tell you right now. Um, I am not going to be coming every freaking day to get one of these. But the fact that it, I have been following upon Impossible before they even released anything, and the fact that they're now in Burger King, that's really freaking cool to me, and um, that's really why I wanted to try it. Will I be getting it every single day? Definitely not. 
when I'm over here once every month or two, will I maybe get one? Maybe. Um, I think it's just cool that it's at Burger King. That's really why I wanted to try it. I have not had beef for four or five years. Um, so I can cannot perfectly judge how it tastes to like regular beef because it's been so long. But if you gave me this, I would think, yo, that's freaking meat, dude. So that's just what I think right off the bat. So I just want to let you guys know. I haven't had a fast food burger for four or five years. I now understand why America is in the state that they are in. This tastes bloody good, but finally understand why the state that America is in. I've always been like, why the heck is America doing this to themselves? And now that I taste this and remind myself, I kind of understand. I'm gonna have dinner tonight, so I'm not gonna finish this, but I think it's freaking good, guys. I think if you have a Burger King, go freaking try it, 100%. But that's basically going to wrap up this video, guys. That was it. The Impossible Whopper. So thank you guys for watching. Peace out, guys.